If you've ever had a dog, you'd know that a lot of the time they do some pretty weird things. Some like to flirt with you or are constantly at your feet, while others like to channel their inner goat. And that's not all. So stick around for 15 awkward dog behaviors and the explanation behind them. Number 15, trying to bite their own tail. Almost every dog owner that has existed has tried to bite or at least chase their own tail. Some do it more than others, but more or less they all do it. Even though it looks kind of awkward and weird, it has somewhat of a purpose behind it. The main reason is simply that they're bored. If dogs get bored, they try to fill that time with something productive, and playing with it is productive for them. If they want to play and the closest thing to them just happens to be their own tail, they're going to go for it. However, if your dog is constantly doing that without stopping, they might have something going on with their butt and will have to be taken to a vet instead. Number 14, doing lots of circles before sitting down. Have you ever noticed your dog doing lots of little circles before sitting down or sleeping in their bed? Most people think that they're just trying to achieve maximum comfort to sleep properly, but that's not the case. There's a much deeper meaning behind it. Dogs know that sleeping makes them vulnerable and they can't just be out in the open, vulnerable to an attack. So they like to really prepare their beds before they sit in it and then sit in the exact position that would be the best to spring into action if an intruder comes in. They're cute and smart. Number 13, eating grass. If you've ever walked up to your dog and saw them channeling their inner goat and eating a bunch of grass, don't worry, they're not having an identity crisis, they might just have an upset stomach. Grass has fiber, and if your dog is having tummy issues, they'll try to fix it themselves by chomping on some grass and upping their overall fiber intake. That way, they get themselves a crunchy snack and their stomach feels better too. Number 12 eating poop. This one is straight up disturbing, but you'll be surprised to hear just how many dogs actually eat their own poop. This is something dogs tend to do if they're stressed out or want a reaction out of their owners. In either case, you would need to pay attention to figure out what's causing the distress because even though it's normal for dogs to do this, it almost always stems from stress. However, it is generally considered safe if they do eat their own poop, but if they're going after their poop of other animals or dogs, that's where the danger of germs, parasites, and diseases lie. So you need to put a stop to that if it happens. Number 11, winking. If you walk into the room and your dog starts winking at you, just know that they're not flirting with you or being cute. They might just have something in their eye. Unlike us, they don't have fingers or know how to properly use a mirror to get something out of their eye. So they do the only thing they know will help, come to the owner. The safest way to clean out their eyes is by using dog safety eye drops. They'll quickly flush out the dog's eyes and have them be good as new. Number 10, sniffing butts. If you're a new dog owner, one of the weirdest things you'll notice your dog doing is sniffing the butts of other dogs and just animals in general. Well, it's because butts are the equivalent to faces for dogs. Just like all humans have a unique face, all dogs have a unique scent, and that scent is concentrated in the butt. That's why whenever two dogs see each other, they immediately bolt to the butt to check out their ID, just in case they've met before. If they haven't, they move on to a formal hello instead. Number nine, rolling around in poop. Uh, nothing's worse than when you've just bathed your dog and they decide that being clean is not the way they want to live life. And they bolt to the stinkiest, poopy spot they can find in the grass and go ham rolling around in it. This is one of the most frustrating, weird things dogs do, but there is some thought behind it. Historically, dogs have had to survive. Part of that is making sure no one can track them, and there's no better way to mask your scent by rolling in some poop. 
The only thing is that since dogs do this instinctively, they don't really remember that it's not something they need to do. No one's tracking them out of their walk, but they're going to roll around in some poop just in case. Number eight, picking up their food and taking it away. If your dog picks up their food from the place you placed it to another room, there are two things that could be at play. If they take it to a separate area where they're alone, it means they either need their privacy or they are threatened, which could be the case if they have other dogs in the house. If they're bringing the food from a separate area to you, they're feeling lonely or just like eating around you. Number seven, putting their butt on your toes. No matter how much you love your dog, you probably don't want their bare bottom on your toes, right? Well, you might change your mind when you hear what they're really doing. They don't think of you as a cushy seat. They're just trying to put their scent on you so other dogs know you're theirs. How cute is that? They're just showing their love. In a weird way, but it is still love. Number six, creating a treasure lair. In the wild, dogs used to have the instinct to go hunt things and bring them back to their home to eat later. And to some extent, that instinct still exists. That's part of the reason why dogs just pick up random things and take them to their treasure lair, which is usually either under their bed, couch, or table, or in a secret part of your house that you haven't even discovered yet. It's supposed to be a hidden lair after all, right? Number five, tilting their heads continuously. You've probably seen lots of videos of dogs doing that adorable head tilt from side to side. And while most of the time it's just because they've heard a sound that's a different pitch than the regular sounds in the room, or a trigger word that gets them excited like walk, but that's not what it actually is. If your dog has pain in their ears or has water in their ears, they'll keep tilting their heads in an attempt to get it to you. If you're seeing too much tilting going on, get them to a vet. Number four, twitching or running in their sleep. There are several videos all over the internet where dogs are twitching or even running in their sleep. This is something that almost all dog owners have seen their dog do at one point or another, and it can be pretty confusing to figure out what's going on or if they need help. Well, just like humans, dogs go into REM stage of sleep too, and the twitching is just the reaction to them dreaming. Most of the time, it's just a regular old dream, but if they're freaking out and yelling while dreaming, you might wanna gently wake them up but generally they should just wake up on their own and will be fine. Number three, licking human feet. Dogs have particularly slimy tongues, which is why it's kind of weird when they suddenly just come and start licking your feet and make them all wet too. But did you know the meaning behind that? Well, when mother dogs have babies, they lick their paws as a way of showing their love. And as they grow up, they recognize you as their owner. If they come and lick your feet, it's them being submissive and showing you their admiration. Or if you have stinky feet, they just like the smell or taste of them. So you might want to take a whiff of your feet to figure out which one of these might be the case. Number two, scooting their butts. Nothing's weirder than sitting in your lounge watching TV and randomly seeing your dog scoot their butt across the floor. This is something many dogs tend to do, but it's not something they do for fun. It usually means that something's going on with their butt. This could mean either they have an itch or something is wrong with their anal glands or even something like a UTI. If you're noticing your dog scoot their butt too often, take them to the vet to figure out what's really going on. Number one, humping your leg. This one's a classic. There are way too many instances where you're going about your day or having a night in with your friends and suddenly your dog begins to hump your uh, or someone else's leg. This awkward behavior either means that they've got too much pent up energy or are excited. They could be stressed out or simply asserting their dominance showing you who's boss. Whatever the case may be, no one really wants their leg humped by their dog. 
So if the behavior persists, you might want to talk to their vet to rule out any underlying issues. All right, let us know in the comments which of these awkward dog behaviors does your dog partake in. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to InfoLab, and we'll see you in the next one.